This is our bacteria overview figure, and in this video, we'll be discussing salmonella, which you can see right here. When we say salmonella, we're primarily referring to salmonella enterica, and there are thousands of salmonella serotypes, so in this video, we'll refer to all of these as simply salmonella. In the next video, we'll discuss salmonella typhi, which is the only other type of salmonella species you need to be familiar with. This scene will take place on the river as a fun outdoor fishing trip. To represent salmonella, we've shown several salmon fish swimming in the river. So salmon for salmonella. Salmonella is gram-negative, so to represent this, we've made the background red, similar to our other gram-negative videos. Salmonella is also flagellated, so notice that we've also shown a flag in this boat to represent this idea. Flag, flagellated. This is a gram stain of salmonella. Notice that it appears red or pink under the microscope and is rod-shaped. Also notice that it's a flagellated organism. You can see the flagella, for example, right here. Okay, with this in mind, let's return to the image. Notice that now we've added our first character to the scene. He's trying to catch a fish with a net that completely surrounds the fish, just like a capsule completely surrounds a bacterium. So the net in this part of the image is here to help you remember that salmonella is encapsulated. Next, notice that we've shown a fish bleeding in the water. He must have been caught earlier and then let loose, and now we can see a trail of blood behind him. Poor fish. Anyway, the trail of blood is here to help you remember that salmonella spreads hematogenously. 